guys, I'm Hybrid Fox Kid, and welcome back to Minecraft. And this time, instead of it being a bingo challenge, it is an SMP that I have made together with a couple friends. So this is the Three Nations SMP, which me and two other friends are building together in. So we've got me, Obsidian Skies, and Undeniably Remy. Um, and in this server, it's essentially us three have picked our own biome to each build a massive city in, or country, or nation, as the title entails, the nations. So I'm going to pop up the map of our little starter area at the moment, and going to show you the first by uh, the first nation is Glacius, which is my nation, which is uh, the snowy nation, and then we've got Obsidian Skies nation, Nevia, which is the jungle nation. And then we've got the Mushroom Nation, which is probably not going to be a Mushroom Nation anymore, not sure. Uh, Magnus Void. So that's undeniably Remy's nation. So throughout the time, we're going to slowly start from the ground up and make big sprawling cities. So yeah, we're going to have to wait and see. But yes, I'm going to jump in my boat that was gifted so kindly from Obsidian. And I'm going to go over to my starting nation area. While I'm boating here, we did mess around for the first couple hours of this server's life. Um, and I'm just going to show you some funny clips from it now. We had a pretty good time just yelling and screaming and dying a lot. So, hope you enjoy. Ooh, I, I feel found very safe boat. here. I should not say that. I hope you I'm say that die. and a creeper drops on you because that would be really funny. <laughs> Don't jinx me! It'd be funny though! <laughs> That's not very nice. I'm sorry. Although I do hear a zombie and that's making my own coffee. It's a zombo. Out in his... Uh, oh, no natural habitat. Here. Oh, some yes. books, some paper, and a buried treasure map. I told you you'd be the one with more stuff soon. Oh, uh, no. Are you okay? Guys! Guys! Oh. Not like no! <laughs> you had there the you first go. death! <laughs> First death. <laughs> oh <Wow>. no. <gasps> Some iron. Kitty. You're a little grey kitty as well. Come here, bud. Where'd you go? <gasps> he loved me. <laughs> Come on, Bishop, you're coming with me. Here we go. Come on. Look, iron is nice and everything, but I would really appreciate some diamonds. Since I've been down here for so long. <laughs> I do not know how to read these maps. Ooh, With good great job. skill. Good job. It's a skill I don't have. <laughs> Oh, no, no, no. Oh, come on. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. I just have to think I hate you. <laughs> I haven't even stepped up, like, underground yet. I'm still above ground. Oh, like, don't, <laughs> don't, don't rub it in. <laughs> that was the only thing I grabbed out of that chest. I gotta go back down. What else did I get? Never. Oh, that's a lot of iron. TNT and cooked fish. Okay, I can, get rid I can get this rid of the raw fish. And what else can I get rid of? Uh, I don't know, I kind of need everything in my inventory. Uh, chest plate, don't need it. I'm so upset right now. <laughs> oh no. Oh, you got it! Yay! I was that far Yay. away from getting it and you oh. took it from me. <laughs> I need oh, a drink. Yeah. Oh, I think this might be a part of Glacius, but I don't know because I came out of the wrong side. I'm hungry though. Yeah, but it also gives me some hearts. <laughs> oh no! No! 
No. I thought I was in an air pocket. I've been there before. Just trying to get back to my stuff before it despawns. Not okay. So I don't think I will because I think I'm right around the corner. There it is. Yay. My stuff. Let's go. Yay. Oh, my diamond! Come here. Good. I'm above ground and at my island. <laughs> I'm Mostly also because I don't want to steal people's resources. Fair enough. Party island! Safety island. <laughs> The safety nation. Mm -hmm. <laughs> safety nation. That's it. That's the one. I'm gonna make it like really edgy and like scary looking, and it's just the nice one. Yeah. <laughs> well, with the name Magnus Void. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know what that, what kind of environment you're trying to instill. I know, I'm gonna literally try to make it the most terrifying place, and that is just really nice. <laughs> Will you offer free cake? Yeah. Hmm. You get cake at the door. <laughs> I might go see if I can get stuff out of that boat. Boat. Uh, did I have spruce pillaring? Is it half in the water? Did you steal my boat? It was in the water. <laughs> did you steal my boat? <laughs> it was in the water. I can't believe you've done this. <laughs> I I'm gonna go check it to make sure you stole this boat. There we I go. It. I can't believe you stole my boat. I'll never forgive you. <laughs> You can say it was for the greater good. Now this is why the war sparks. Oh god! <laughs> You've done it. You've started the war. I've started the war already. Yep. <laughs> if this boat has been taken, all hell is gonna break loose. Uh oh. Uh -oh. <laughs> uh -oh. <laughs> I can't believe you've done this. Oh no! Oh, I can't believe you've the done drama. This. We barely been on this server for a couple hours and we're already starting a fight. Yeah, that's it. <laughs> oh no. It wouldn't have happened if you didn't steal the boat. <laughs> and if it's the same boat, that was the one that got me the diamond. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh no. Oh, I don't no. take lightly to these. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, they're up on the hill for some reason. They're just hanging out. I would like them to not. So I can keep them safe. I mean, that's fair. Hey, buddy. Pal, friend. Uh, of course you want to walk away from me. Mm hmm. Yep. Go on. Find your spot. One, two, three. Find your, find your door. One, two, put the water in there. Jesus, yeah. this is there you go. precarious. There you go, buddy. Okay, you want to go this way? All right, I'll follow you. Okay. Good job, buddy. You can stay in there forever now. Gotta find a spot. Too. Oh yeah! Ooh. That was clean. Compared to the bingo one? Yes. <laughs> it's incredibly was... clean. I'm kinda of proud of myself. Not as fast, but I'm proud. <laughs> so as we climb up this hill, you're going to see that we still have little Bishop, which is the cat that I found while I was searching through that village and then we've got a couple of the stuff that I just my own little home base that is very unprotected and got a lot of monsters coming to kill me so I've prepped this area for my starter house I still got to prep it a little bit more 
Um, I've got to do a resource run, grab a bunch of resources, and then start building the house. So I think I'm going to do the house in a little time-lapse motion, so I'll be back when the house is all built and finished. is the first house we have built for Glacius. Um, it's pretty good. I, I like it. It turned out nice. Um, wanted to use all the colours, like very medieval style build. Um, you'll probably get to know pretty quickly that I like old fantasy related stuff, so expect a lot of builds to look like this. I've also done the interior, which isn't anything special. It's not too good. Uh, yeah. Nothing really to write home about, but it's got a nice little viewing stand, and you can see Spawn, and for some reason it's not loading in either of the other two nations, but yeah, sometimes it does, sometimes it doesn't. I don't know why it doesn't, but yeah. So that's the first little house, and the bishop's little seedy place there, he's happy there. But yeah, um, I do want to get more snow, I gotta wait for it to snow again, I kind of just relocated all this snow here to over here to make it look a little bit more packed, and then I gotta wait for the snow so it can snow on the roof and add more like wintry kind of vibes and snowy vibes. But with this place, I do want to make it feel big, like the vibe I want to give off when people are walking through here to look up and look around at everything happening above and then everything below is like bustling and I want it to make look very busy like a busy marketplace kind of town and I don't want to terraform too much I want to kind of keep these natural dips and crevices and all that so hopefully even though I'm not very skilled at building hopefully it will turn out well I've got a lot of really big plans for this area and I've got a lot of area to work with. It just keeps on going and going and going. So I've got a lot of time and a lot of space to build with. So hopefully with that, I'll have a lot of fun and try out different building styles. One last thing I wanna do before I end off today's episode is I wanna make a little uh, snow golem area. So I don't have to be digging up my entire front yard to be able to decorate the rest of my other part of my nation. I don't know how this works, I'm just going to hopefully wing it. And we'll see how that goes. I think I just have to pop the button here. Yep, perfect. There we go. I think I get rid of the cobblestone. Hopefully they can't... Nope. There we go. I will make this prettier afterwards, I just want to actually get it working. Oh no! Oh, that was close. What if I just ping pong? There we go. Then I should just... Yeah, there we go. Uh, once I have a more iron, I will um, make hoppers and make it a semi-automate... Whoops, sorry bud. Make it a semi-automated system. But yeah, this is going to be my income from sno for snowballs now. Ha! Huh, I like that. Well, it's very makeshift. I am going to make it look prettier than this, probably between episodes, so don't expect this ugly monstrosity to stick around for very long. I got some stuff done, made my house, going to change the inside probably between episodes as well, because I still don't like the inside. Um, but yeah, I hope you guys are looking forward to this series. I, I want a game to just mess around with and just show off like get skills in like building stuff in games and stuff like that because that's one thing I never really dabble in. 
all good. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed the episode. If you did, give it a like and maybe subscribe if you want to stick around. All good. I'll see you guys next time. See ya.